what's up y'all it's your girl diamond dick Hira, and i'm here to jump into the talk about ddg and hallie mm. so hallie has been getting smoke <laughs> they've been chewing hallie up they've been chewing hallie up and it's because she is mad because ddg went on kai Sinat little streaming thing that everybody go on and she pissed that he brought her son on there without telling her now nah, people been chewing hallie the fuck up like <laughs> they have been telling her like girl that's his son you you know why are you mad like you know what's the issue and i see it from both sides because at the end of the day, that is also his son, too. And his son was in no type of harm's way. He wasn't. I mean, yeah, he is in front of a whole bunch of people. But she knew that when she got with this man, that as a YouTuber, that he was going to be posting his son a lot. She should have known that. First of all, DDG is the same one who posted her pregnant. He didn't post her pregnant, but he was making a video and she was seen pregnant in the background. And he still posted it, even knowing she was in the background looking pregnant and she was trying to hide it. She should have known that he was going to be showing that baby everywhere. Like, that is just what it is. Like, but on the same side, like on the flip side, not the same side, but on the flip side, she also probably is getting fed up with the fact that her son is being put out there because she said that she's seeing her baby you know on every platform and then a million people is watching her baby which i think she's getting fed up with it because on everybody like well what did you expect like he ain't doing nothing wrong like da, 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 da. that's his child too like why he can't have his baby on the stream in front of millions of people what's the problem the problem is she did not know that the baby was going to be posted this much she did not know that ddg was going to be posting this baby this often and honestly i feel like this may be the reason why they could be broken up allegedly i'm not confirming nothing or i'm not putting out no false information but this could be one of the factors as to why they did not work out he's a youtuber he's gonna post a baby she probably wanna you know hallie if y'all look at who ddg is if you watch ddg before you know how ddg is he was going to post that baby regardless like it was not going to matter you know i don't even think it would have mattered who his baby mama was he was going to post that baby regardless it just so happened that his baby mama is hallie and hallie is a more private lady if you watched hallie and chloe you know that hallie is the more reserved one she's the more demure one if you want to you know put it into some type of context she's more closed off um she posts when she needs to or when she's feeling you know herself or whatnot but she's not the one to put her business out there we did not know hallie's business before she started talking to ddg we don't even know who she dated before we don't know too much about hallie because she's not that type of person we know a lot about ddg if you wanted to know about ddg more you could easily go watch a lot of his videos and you would have learned who ddg was or you would have got a gist of the type of person he was he's very much he's not i don't, don't want to say he a clout chaser but he's a youtuber that's his job it's not like he's um doing anything out of the ordinary and that's the thing that's the problem that's why everybody is going up they eating fucking Haley up because they like bitch why are you so mad about your baby daddy having your son on the stream like what's the problem but like i said she probably did not expect for him to do this and i know some of y'all are like well he can do whatever he wants like why is he what's the problem the problem is that he don't have to post his son like he don't have to add his son and everything he could be a youtuber and not post his son he could be a youtuber and i'm not saying he has to not post his son but he don't have to post his son as much he purposely 
gets his camera, put Halo in the camera, and play with Halo and do stuff like that in front of the camera so that everybody can see. And But he's a vlogger. He does, he does all, like, he does everything that YouTubers do. So it's like, I get why Haley upset because you don't want to see your son everywhere, people talking about him. All of this and that. She probably feeling real protective over her of her child. On the flip side, DDG like shit. This my baby. This my son. I want to get him out here. You know, I want to have fun with him, show him to everybody. You know, he's just happy as a dad, which is good. But I think they need to get a mutual ground with how they're going to continue to raise their son because I don't think Hallie is happy with the fact that. Halo is being put on everything all the time and um honestly somebody got to say it but DDG is getting paid a lot of money for having that baby. He's getting paid a lot of money for posting that baby. This is the most DDG has been talked about in a long time. Like he got talked about a lot when he started talking to ha um Hallie. He got talked about a lot when she got pregnant. And now, even after they broke up, that baby is was keeping him even more relevant, you know? And he's going to keep using the baby to stay relevant because that's bringing him a lot of views. If you look at his views on his channel, he his views go up with Halo. They do. And I'm sorry. If anybody thinks that he's just posting his baby out of sure joy for... Being a dad. Mm. Clock that T. He's getting paid a lot of money for posting his baby. And I think that's why Hallie is more so mad about it. It's like, it's not that you're just posting our son having a good time. You're posting our son a lot for content. And honestly, a conversation need to be had about these content creators using their child. And y'all want to give DDG a pass because he's a YouTuber. But I mean, like, when the baby gets older, do you think the baby is going to like the fact that he has so much attention? Or do you think the baby is going to be rather wanting to be private? Halo is going to grow up into his own person and he once he gets to a certain age he's going to be able to decide if he wants to stay in front of you know the camera or if he wants to be more private like how you know other celebrity kids are and that's the thing like I think the privacy versus being public is what Halle and DDG is really struggling with I don't really think it's like oh she don't want him to be a dad she don't want no i don't think that's it at all i think she loves the fact that she can leave her child with her child's father i think that's i think she would appreciate that actually but it's the fact that he probably didn't discuss it with her which she said that she wasn't told or wasn't notified which a lot of people are like well that's his son you don't have to tell her that's both of their son he does have to tell her what he's doing with their son it's not just his son and it's not just her son so the way y'all try to be like oh well he didn't have to say nothing to her y'all are the same ones that be crying when y'all baby daddy don't do something or do something and don't tell y'all y'all be the same ones mad at y'all baby daddy for doing shit like that so i don't know why y'all trying to set up here and defend ddg because if it was your baby daddy if your baby daddy took your son over to his new bitch house and didn't tell you you would be mad i don't know that bitch why are you taking my baby over there hallie might feel the same way about kai sanat yeah he kai sanat y'all motherfuckers might think y'all know him but y'all don't know him for real hallie probably like i don't know that man why you ain't tell me you was taking him over there Though Kai Sinat isn't a bad person and he's on a streaming thing, so of course he wouldn't do nothing bold. But it's just a simple fact. Why didn't you just tell me that that's where y'all was going to be? So I wouldn't be second guessing or worried about, you know. And then she finds out through people posting. And then also, you got to think, every time DDG have Halo, they're telling, they're tagging Hallie in it. 
like they're tagging Hallie in everything DDG does with the baby. And that's probably frustrating to Hallie because she like, girl, like, okay, that's my son's father. That's my son. Like, okay. But I think, like I said, she's getting fed up with it. But I don't think neither of them is wrong or right. But people don't have to come for Hallie like that because y'all have to think she just had this baby. She just had this baby. They're fresh on a breakup. She probably going through postpartum right now. And she probably going through a lot because she thought that she was going to be with him. Like, you know, she probably in her feelings because she thought like, dang, this was supposed to be my man. Like, we were supposed to be making these decisions together with my child as a unit. And now that they broke up, you know, now they have to split up how they're going to raise their child. She might not agree with the fact that their baby has to be posted every time he posts. She probably tried to talk him into not showing their baby so much. Like, hey, can you make your YouTube content without posting our son every time? And, you know, like, yeah, you can have your son in your videos, but you don't have to put him directly in front of the camera. And, you know, can you be a little light with it? And he probably was like, girl, this is my job. And also, I love being a dad. I can do whatever I want with my son. It's my son. And he's not wrong. Nobody's wrong. He ain't wrong. She ain't wrong either. They're just not in agreement with each other. They don't have to agree to disagree and find out how they're going to move forward with it. The only thing she can do is tell him, like, hey, just let me know when you're going to do these things. That's it. Just let me know. That's the only thing. You can't be mad. She she can do whatever she wants, but at the same time, she can't be mad that her son is being seen in front of millions of people. Whether it was on Kai Sinat stream or if it was on DDG's platform, he was going to get seen in front of millions of people regardless. Okay? So, yeah, I honestly feel bad for them. I wish they would have stayed together because I think if they would have stayed together, um they probably wouldn't be going through this right now they probably would have been together already and probably had a discussion or something but also sometimes men feel like if y'all are not in a relationship he doesn't have to tell you anything at all you know and that's probably what that is as well like he probably like girl we're not together so i don't even really have to express to you what i'm doing with my son because this is my son but hey who knows hopefully they didn't get it together because they's tearing my girl Hallie up and I love Hallie and I feel bad for her because she would have not been in so much public scrutiny if she was not with DDG Hallie has never been in negative public light before besides her being with DDG the only other time people was on her ass was when um what happened? It was when she didn't want everybody to know she was pregnant. She kept telling everybody, oh, I'm not pregnant. I'm not pregnant. Cussing people out, actually. Like, y'all need to stay out of my business. Da, 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 da. And that was when I knew, like, she wasn't ready for what, what was about to come. Because if you're telling people to stay out your business... But your baby daddy is posting videos of stuff with you there. Why did you think that your baby was going to be private? You wasn't, he wasn't able to keep you private while you were trying to stay private. And while Hallie probably wanted to be one of them people who had their baby and went ducked off with their man and their baby, that's just not what happened. You got to think also, Hallie is up under Beyonce's management. And we all know how Beyonce is. She don't post much. She don't show much of nothing. I think Hallie wanted that. I think Hallie wanted that level of privacy to where y'all don't know what I'm doing. I'll show y'all little bits and pieces. Because she did still post Halo. She just don't post Halo nearly as much as DDG. She posts Halo too but she don't post halo all the time she's not purposely putting him in content trying to make memes and stuff like that and videos and vlogs and stuff like she's not actively trying to purposely have halo and everything she does and post it you know 
Because DDG can do everything with his son and not post it. But he's going to post it because he knows that's how he's going to get paid. He gets paid off his lifestyle. He gets paid off of um, gaming and all this other streaming and all this other stuff. And of course, he's going to have his son. So, you know, she going to have to take one on the chin. I wish she wouldn't go to the internet and start like... Ugh, I hate that people use the internet for like relationship like I don't know like what are you looking for by going to the internet and telling the internet about like and that's the thing when she was pregnant she was all oh I, I y'all need to stay out of my business now you throwing us in your business by making posts I hope Hallie takes this time of um my bad i hope hallie takes this time to really realize what she signed up for and what she's gonna have to deal with whether this was a deal breaker to you or not this is your baby daddy you don't have a choice at this point if he don't want to post your son you gonna have to he's gonna post your son whether you want your son to be posted everywhere or not boo it's just it is what it is i hope they get it together i hope y'all like this little tea time this little talk Tap me with me on my Instagram at diamond underscore underscore Dakira. That's a D-A-K-Y-R-A. And we'll be back with another episode. Thank you for tuning into Urban Girl Podcast. Bye.